Uh, all right, so we'll play more episodes, and we'll just play five minutes at a time. We'll bring you from a little town in Budapest, or around Budapest, up past World War II, and moving here to the States, and get nominated for an Academy Award, and the whole, the whole nine yards from that little kid in that little town with the two dead mommies. That, by the way, is what why this country used to be great. It was a whole, it was a million plus of those stories. Not a bunch of self-entitled pricks. My grandfather never came here and said, you got to print the uh, DMV pamphlet in Hungarian and I need the signs to be in English in Hungarian and I need a Hungarian uh, as a second language student, a teacher at my school. Like, no, nope, you come here, you learn English, you get along and you'll thrive. Not, we're going to create a little little Budapest and then you can just sit there and surround yourself in your own language, in your own culture and don't worry about having to change anything. We'll cut off a slice of it right here for you. No, because then my grandfather never would have become what he became if someone just moved Hungary to some part of the valley over here and just said, stay there and yeah, never leave. I'll bet he wrote a letter to the Wienerschnitz on his day. Oh, my God. They come to the valley. Now you can laugh when you say, when you when I tell the story every third show about him seeing the North Hollywood Wienerschnitzel, you know, open in two days with the big sign, Der Wienerschnitzel, up there, and him going, finally some good schnitzel brought to North Hollywood. Finally. And then the single tear rolling down his cheek as the 14-year-old asked me wanted a corn dog and a Pepsi. Like, what? Schnitzel! <laughs> I'm from Nierenschausen. It's the schnitzel capital of the world. This yeah. will never stand in Nierenschausen, Salsa. Yeah. You, want some, <laughs> you want some curly fries with that old man? What? What is curry? 